Hello everybody, it is Russ here with another video once again, and I wanted to do a story time video today for all of you, for those of you that may be new to my channel and might not know things about me that you want to know more about, I'm going to fill you in. Now, this was something that was discussed in regards to me in the past, and um, I would like to let you all know, because I still feel like it's kind of relevant, uh, in regards to my story and my life, um, I'd like to let you all know about the fact that I am a recovering alcoholic. When I was 21, I had a Four loco for the first time, and I also had a glass of anisette, which is known as Italian liqueur. And, um, I ended up going to the emergency room because of it. And I had what is known as a heart murmur, and that is a hole in the heart. And it's closed up now, but it was really bad around the time that I ended up going to the hospital. I have never um, done any hard drugs like Kratom, LSD, shrooms, or whatever. Um, I've also never self-harmed. I have had thoughts of doing that before, but I've never done it. And I've also struggled with suicidal thoughts and depression and anxiety. And that's one of the main reasons why I don't, I'm very susceptible when it comes to taking any form of verbal abuse from people. Um, because, you know, as everybody has been saying, oh, Russ is not, you know, no sensitive ass bitch. No, I'm not. I'm not. But there are times where I can't handle somebody just screaming and yelling at me. Um... Another thing I want to share is this is another reason why I have trouble dealing with people like getting really angry at me. Before um, my grandmother passed away, she pretty much verbally abused me my entire life. And that is why, that's another reason why I don't want to have to continue to deal with people just shit talking me and just saying all sorts of, you know, rude things towards me. I understand it's the internet. I understand that if you are going to be on YouTube and you're going to be a content creator and you're going to be successful in any way, shape or form, you have to put up with it because it's part of the job. It's part of what you sign up for when you enter the realm of social media and you enter the realm of being an influencer and you enter the realm of being a content creator. But there are a lot of people that just cannot deal with it. And I am one of them. I am one of the people that cannot put up with somebody just treating me like I'm some dog on the street. Now, if you choose not to believe this because everybody continues to um, just go over what I've said in the past and just continues to think that everything I say is a lie because they just want to feed their own false notions and beliefs in regards to me, that's fine. You don't have to believe this story, but... I'm letting you all know this because if I didn't, I feel like I would be doing a huge disservice to people that are new 
when it comes to my community and people that have already been in my community. And that's all I really wanted to say. So I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. I'll see you later.